While some kinds of miso are fine to eat on a keto diet, many contain rice, barley or other grains. Therefore, I improvised using other ingredients to make this Asian keto miso soup recipe. Miso paste is comprised of fermented soybeans. The length of time they have been fermenting dictates the taste. Lighter, short fermented miso will have a sweeter flavor, while a red miso, which has been fermented longer, will have a stronger, more potent flavor. Studies illustrate that people on low-carb and keto diets lose more weight, faster, than those on low-fat diets, even when the latter are actively restricting calories. Before I move on in this video, would you like to know exactly what you need to lose fat and get healthy without giving up your favorite foods or starving yourself? If your answer is yes, then you got to grab this. I have developed a 60-day personal keto diet, which would be fully customized as per your gender, age, height, and weight. Click on the first link in the description to grab your customized keto diet, which is available absolutely free, but only for a limited time. This dish can be considered a middle-of-the-road miso, miso less miso, with other ingredients stepping in to provide a similar flavor. I opted for tahini sauce and tamari sauce, make sure yours is gluten-free, to stand in for miso. Tamari sauce, in particular, is pretty close, it's also made from fermented soybeans. Sesame oil and lemon juice help round out the flavor. Shrimp substitutes. If you do not care for shrimp, feel free to leave it out. I am happy to eat this soup without additional protein, but there are lots of options if you do want a more robust soup. Here are some suggestions for topping your keto soup without shrimp. Chicken. Salmon. Turkey. Beef. If you like a spicier dish, add a bit of hot sauce into the broth. For a more traditional miso soup recipe, take a look here. Asian Keto Miso Soup Recipe, Topped with Shrimp. Ingredients. 2, 3 ounces or 85 grams, packs of shirataki noodles, drained. 2.5 cups of chicken broth, 600 milliliters, or bone broth. 1 tablespoon of tahini sauce, 15 milliliters. 1 tablespoon of gluten-free tamari sauce or coconut aminos, 15 milliliters. Half a pound of shrimp, 225 grams, peeled. 1 teaspoon of sesame oil, 5 milliliters. 2 tablespoons of lemon juice, 30 milliliters. 2 green onions, 10 grams, sliced at an angle. 1 cup of spinach, 30 grams, thinly sliced. Dash of hot sauce, optional. Instructions. Rinse the shirataki noodles very well, as per the packet instructions to eliminate the smell. It also helps to boil it up a bit and then rinse again. Drain and set aside. Heat the broth and add the tahini sauce and tamari sauce. Once steaming hot, add the shrimp, sesame oil, and lemon juice and keep on the heat until you are certain the shrimp have cooked through. Add the drained noodles into the broth along with the green onions and thinly sliced spinach and warm through. Divide between two bowls and serve immediately with a dash of hot sauce. Notes. All nutritional data are estimated and based on per serving amounts. Net carbs, 3 grams. In this channel I always come up with different low-carb keto diet and recipes to help people find innovative and new ways to reduce weight. Definitely try it on your own and let me know your feedback in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to grab your free customized keto plan from the link in description. Subscribe to my channel, The Keto World, for daily low-carb recipes and diets which would definitely help you shed some of that belly fat. Like and share the video with your friends. Also, join my Facebook group from the link in the description for more such recipes, diet and weight loss techniques.